I'm feeling very disconnected and I'm going to tell you why. Every morning, every morning, like Monday through Friday, unless Ellie and I have an appointment to do something else, she either comes to my house or I come to her house and we work for like four or five hours together. And I never bring the camera and I never do Insta stories because we're like, we're, we're very in thought, we're very concentrated in what we're doing. And I'm just showing you my outfit as I talk. <laughs> In case you were wondering what I was doing. Okay, we'll back up now. <laughs> Don't judge me. Mm. Anyway, so I feel like I have this like big part of my life that I never film. And so it's almost like you don't know what I'm doing. So we're out of the loop on each other. And maybe that's why I feel so stressed out all the time. is because of like things that we're dealing with. Because we really are trying to get better right now. Um, for the last couple of months, okay, let me give you an example of the stuff that we've been working on. We hired out a third, sorry, I just kicked Wadey on accident. I meant to open my foot and I kicked her. I'm Maybe sorry. For the last several months, we hired out a third party company to help us with our sizing so that our sizes match a, a big, uh, Mm, I was gonna say most of the other stores, but they're all so different. So we took the type of stores that we um, like to shop at, the kind of style of clothes that we like, um, that way we fit in the same genre, and we took um, a lot of their sizing, just looked at it, but um, the girl that we have is a professional, and so she kind of took the, I couldn't even tell you how she does it, I think she took the middle of like everything and used her own common sense and just really put together um, a different fitting size chart, and so our spring clothing that's coming out is going to Hopefully, I haven't tried it on yet. We actually are going to New York to try it on this week. Um, the sizing will fit really well. I feel like the sizing did fit really well in the small, medium, large, extra large, extra, extra large. But when you get up into the extra large and on, that's a whole nother pattern. And that's why it's more expensive for companies to produce um, XL sizes is because it's a whole new pattern. You don't just scale up. And what we've done is scaled up. And I think we've done a really good job at it, but considering we've never done it before and we have no knowledge in it, I think we've done really well. But we want it to be perfect. So they're working on those plus sizes. And then I left off the extra small size because I don't feel like it has scaled as well either. So anyway, they've done good. We've done good. Um, and maybe some I don't know, Joel might be like, what are you saying? I don't, you don't need to say all this, but I think it's really fun to be transparent and to kind of let you know like what we've been up to and what I've been doing. I'm very, very happy that we've done this. It is not a cheap route to go. It's very expensive to have someone come in and do your sizing, but I think in the long run, it's like the most important. If our sizes don't fit you guys, then that's, there's no, there's no point in selling our clothes. So. I'm proud of the progress that we're making and moving in the right direction, but it is a whole nother ball game. Like what we're doing is it's next level and it's just different. I never thought I would be doing this. There's just a lot more to it than you would think. Same with like vlogging. It's like you guys have heard me say so many times, it's not as easy as just picking up a camera and recording because it really isn't. If I mean, if you could do that way, but I don't think you'll grow very well doing it that way. There has to be some sort of strategy behind it, you know? So anyway. Hey, Vaughn. I'm smelling what you're stepping in. Does that mean I'm cut off? No, that means I get what you're saying. I'm cut off. Oh, boring Bonnie won't shut the f up. You come when I called your name from downstairs all the way? Here. Speaking of progress, this little girl will sit here while Joel edits and just love life. And guess what? She's mine. Well, <laughs> who found her? That was me. <laughs> who brought her here to us? <laughs> that was so sweet. Yeah because I don't like cuddle her as much, but she knows that I love her. Oh, yeah. She'll come and find me when she's ready to just sit mm -hmm. but the and past sleep. Three days, she'll nap on me while I work. And yeah. I love it. Yeah, you'll be a good girl while I'm <laughs> mine, okay? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I wish she would howl. I want her to howl like <laughs> you can't believe. Okay, put her back in her bed. Go back in your bed.
Oh my gosh, you're a happy girl. Yes, you are. You're a happy girl. Lincoln, yeah. why don't you come upstairs, honey? I'd be lying if I said my toddler doesn't just watch TV all day every day. A lot of times he does, and I think that's okay. But today, maybe we should not let him watch TV. At least the first couple of hours while we just get our stuff done. But Okay, Lincoln, come upstairs. Hey, Bon. Um, where are those packages from? I can't tell you it was Christmas. I feel like they're small. Do you like how I'm sitting over here in the corner? Joel was like, this is my set. Get out of here. I'm cleaning. Hey. And, and you guys will have to check out that vlog tomorrow. Just feeling like a peasant over here. Good. Working on the floor. Well, you work a lot better over there. So Ellie and I just got off the f um, a phone interview with a social media manager. And it's funny because um, I did a video saying, you know, our social media manager quit on us. We're looking for someone uh, with marketing experience, um, a degree in marketing. And I was pleasantly surprised with her resume and we were so excited to talk to her. I didn't realize that she was a viewer until we uh, got on the phone and I was asking her, I said, do you guys, do you have any, um, like, do you, are you familiar with Bali Brand? Do you, or, do you know its background? She's like, oh yeah, I love you and Ellie. And then we were like, oh, that's funny, hi. <laughs> and so then, you know, it was business, we talked, and then we got talking just like a little bit more as if we were going to hire her. And we were like laughing loving at something. Her and laughing. Oh yeah, we were loving her. And we're just like, okay, look at us. We're sitting on my bed in Frumpy my frumpers. Oh yeah, neither of us have gotten ready for the day because we've just we got up, took care of our kids, we worked on Bali. I mean, we both did go get our nails done today. <laughs> hey, I have to film beautiful if I look. Um, it's funny, the same girl does our nails and Ellie's appointment was right after mine. I was like, oh, hey! <laughs> anyway, and so at, towards the end of the conversation, it was, you can tell my mouth is tired. My lisp is getting a little more intense because my chin is like tired because I've been talking all day. Um, or just like on that phone call, it like worked my mouth too much. <laughs> And then Ellie's over here silent. I haven't talked like once today. I know. You were so quiet during it. I, I'm i kind of more overbearing than Ellie. <laughs> well, specifically today, I'm just like, we have a big week. I know. Internal shutdown. I know. We're going to New York tomorrow, and <laughs> we're really tired. Uh, we have to have our A game tomorrow. Okay, anyway. Um, at the end, we were laughing and talking and the girl goes oh my gosh I've never had an interview before where we like laugh and scream because she's like let's rip the band-aid off and start like whatever and I was like yes <laughs> <laughs> rip it off girl <laughs> anyway it was really fun and she said I was expecting you guys to be really businessy and it's funny because we are like I'm I'm strict I like things to be done a certain way but I really like Work doesn't have to be miserable. What's that one song? I'm on vacation every single day because I love my occupation. It, it, it. You are the best example of uh, work hard, play hard. Yeah. Like this morning, like when we work in the mornings, it is not like this. No, we no. We sit down and we both are doing our thing and we talk and then we leave. And sometimes we leave and we're like, we're still friends, right? Like, hey, I know. yeah. And but then we get together and we laugh. Yeah, and we it's we leave not because it's like oh we fought, but it's because no, it's like did you do this? This is what I'm doing. Blah 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 blah. Okay, and gotta go get our kids. Yeah, okay, now I gotta go by. So anyway, I just wanted to like share with you the little dynamic that like went on today. It's kind of fun. It's kind of fun. I'm so grateful that we get to do Bali. I'm just gonna close the vlog here because I want to say this, and I know it's just been like me talking today, but it feels good to connect with you. Sometimes I don't like to share the work because it's like, what all am I gonna say? But today was a really productive day, and I truly feel like Bali, like I know Bali is our future, mm -hmm. and that's what we're going to grow old doing together. I think anyway, I think Olivia will one day take over Bali Rand. At least that's like my goal, that's my dream, that we grow it and make it what it 
it's potentially built to be, you know? I don't know. I love and that. I just really appreciate you guys supporting us and 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 I know I've said this before, but it's because I mean it. Your purchases are not the only way to support us. Um, liking our posts on Instagram, commenting, giving us genuine feedback. If there's something that you want to see different, like let us know. We we're making the clothes for you, so let us know what you want. Anyway, we love you guys so flipping much. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. I truly enjoyed making it for you. I enjoyed talking with you guys today, and that feels good. So, okay, bye.